I've gone and got myself an infringement. How the devil is everyone doing? I hope you're all well. Anyway, today is Monday 7th of October. I think it's the 7th. Anyway, it's 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 a Monday and it's October. <laughs> Actually, yeah, it'll be the first Monday in October. So yeah, it's the 7th. It's got to be. Anyway, getting sidetracked. Um, so it's currently half past five in the morning. Um, I'm just pulled in to Lee Delamere Services to go get a drink. And today, well, I left the yard at quarter past four this morning. It was four o'clock was my starting time, so I've done all my checks. It was quarter past four by the time we left. Anyway, we're off to Wales today. We're going to Port Talbot. A few drops in Swansea. Uh, Cowbridge. And then Caldicott. I think it's six deliveries in total, so not too bad a day. Obviously an early start, but sometimes that means early finish. Bit wet and horrible at the moment now. It's just sort of started raining as I pulled into the services. It's coming down a bit harder now, but we'll see how that goes. Hopefully, it's not too bad by the afternoon, and I can go get my truck washed at the, at the truck stop in Swindon. But if not, never mind. <laughs> have to stay dirty. Right, so we'll get this video on the go, and I'll see you in a. How long is it? Hour and a half. Yeah. Wonderful. And just like that, here we are in Port Talbot. So we're, what, five, four minutes away from the first customer of the day? We've got four pallets for them. And uh, yeah, hopefully that goes nice and smoothly. And hopefully they let me use the toilet because I'm absolutely bursting right now. <laughs> Struggling to hold on. If I hit a large bump, it could be game over. <laughs> oh damn. Starting to wish I stopped off at the last services now, but we'll make it. Just. <laughs> the joys. Oh, bit of a struggle to stay awake now, but. <sighs> now we're sort of down here. So all the deliveries are now within what, half hour of each other, so it's not too bad. Maybe a little bit longer to go do the last two, but yeah, we'll see what happens to that one. I think when I come to have, have me break, 45 minute break, I'm going to have a snooze, I think. I didn't sleep, uh, typical story on a Sunday night, thought oh yeah I'll go to bed reasonably early <sighs> so I went to bed at 9 o'clock thought there was no point going too early because I just went to fall asleep, so yeah getting to bed at 9 o'clock and lo and behold I'm still sort of tossing and turning about 11 o'clock to try and fall asleep 
don't know what time I fell asleep. It must have been about half eleven I fell asleep. So, and then up at three. So not a great deal of sleep last night. But hey, can't be helped sometimes, I suppose. If you can't fall asleep, you can't fall asleep, can you? I'm going to die tonight, I know that. <laughs> Probably be asleep two seconds before I hit the pillow. The key is now, obviously, I have a snooze for my 45. But the key is after that is to try and not have a nap when I get home, because that'll just. I won't be able to fall asleep again tonight. <laughs> we'll get through today, we'll struggle through, we'll get there. If I have to stop, I have to stop, then I. around the corner here, on the left. Hopefully we're not here too long. This one. Yeah, there we go. Okay, let's get this one off, and I'll see you once I'm done. Right, hopefully you can see me now. It's a little bit lighter. So, we had that delivery done. Been here for... 17 minutes? 16 minutes? No, hold on. Brain maths, please. Yeah, 17 minutes. There we go. So, yeah, can't really complain at that. Not too bad at all. Then I managed to go for a wee, which was probably one of the best wees I've had in a while. It got to the stage where it was starting to hurt my kidneys. <laughs> Don't want to do that too often. Oh, not at my age! <laughs> I don't know kidney stones or something yeah that was uh, much needed relief anyway enough about my toilet habits <laughs> I'm sure you all really wanted to know that anyway off to the next one now which is nine and a half miles away 19 minutes apparently and it's in Swansea I haven't been to Swansea for a little while now. Excuse my Welsh accent. I just completely destroyed that. <laughs> Please don't feel offended. As I generally try and do other accents as well. And Rowan them as well. Anyway, off to the next one. See you very soon. Okay, just come up on the next delivery now. Last time I come here, I'll... I had a couple of trucks in front of me. It weren't too bad, but I did have to wait. I think it was about an hour I was there. So hopefully there's not many in there. If there is, I'll uh, go around there and tell them I don't want to be waiting around. Get the delivery off now. <laughs> Might scare them then. <laughs> Might get them to get it off quicker. <laughs> and they think I'm going to terminate them. <laughs> oh, dear. I think I'm delirious and tiredness today. I think that's what it is. <sighs> oh, I've got. I think it's three pallets for this one, so hopefully it won't take too long because they do have to check it all. Just a standard thing with their sort of places. Not everywhere check stuff, but these places do. Oh, need ferret access, I need that lane. Look, there's no one there. Let me go around here. There's always one in all there's two. Oh, everyone's coming this way now. Come on, go, 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 go. That fort's going slowly so it's not too bad. Uh, 
And no dramas. That's good. <laughs> You've said things like that to me before. This is sat nav lady. Oh, there it is. <laughs> it is on my right. I know you are. Uh, but is it in this way for me? Uh, yes. Ah, oh, there's other lorries here. I might have to wait. But we shall see. Oh, there's one other lorry and then go to their own. Alright, let's see if we can find someone, see how long we've got to wait. Hopefully not long. See you soon. Alright, delivery down. And I didn't have to wait too long. That truck that was in front of me was already done. Put me lights on. Um, so I only had to wait for a move and then got straight in the bay. I've been here for 19 minutes. Not too bad at all. Cannot complain. I like it when it goes like that. Anywho, off to the next one now. It's 17 minutes away, which works out to seven and a half miles apparently. Which isn't too bad. I haven't done this one before, so. It's, uh, case of hopefully we find it first time, if not drive out and knock an idiot until we do find it. That's how it normally happens. <laughs> Surprising how much quicker your day goes when you know exactly where the customers are and exactly where the stuff goes. But hey, we all got to learn somewhere. So the first time you go somewhere will be the last time you struggle getting there. Usually. There we go. Alright, see you when I'm near the next one. Alright, <clears throat> oh, excuse me, croak your throat. Must have been all that singing I was doing earlier. <laughs> Nobody needs to hear that. Alright, we're almost at the next one now. Just gonna try and move over if this car allows us. Yep. Thank you very much, Mr. Lupo or up, whatever it was. It's a little Volkswagen. Mr. or Mrs. Could be either. <laughs> Should really check before I say. There you go. Bit hard to see him from like 40 feet away through the mirrors. Turn out to be a miserable old day, isn't it? Never mind. We shall deal with it as we normally do. Thinking about it, I think I might have done this one before. Don't know. place just looks a little familiar. Find out in a minute. Not that you'll be able to see from the camera, but there's a red van parked up over there, and I'm pretty sure that's where the store is that I've delivered to before. Because you've got the American Golf Place there, next door to it. Possibly. Unless that goes as a different name. No. No, okay, it is, it is different. It is somewhere down there, but it's not that place. But I have delivered there before. Just gotta find the correct place now. Oh no, I have been to this one. Yeah. I'm delivering to somewhere on behalf of somewhere. That's how it works. 
So I deliver to them and then they move it on to the actual customer or the customer comes and collects it from them. I think they're like a, a holding firm of some sort. Now we've got to wait for a bit of space so we can go off this black car. Let's go, go, go! There we go. Now, I think I've delivered this place before, but for someone else. So that's where the confusion is. Hard to keep up with all these different places we go to. Especially with my memory. <laughs> Right, it's right down the bottom of this road on the left somewhere. Where that blue fence is, I think. If I recall. Nope, must be further down. Slightly different name. Uh, we'll figure it out in a bit. I'll have to put the old hazards on, pull up, and stop and find it that way. Oh, we'll wait to find out where we're going. We'll see you in a bit. Okay. So that's that one done. That wasn't too bad. It was, it was where I thought it was, but I just thought I saw a different name, so I didn't come in here. And then I looked up on Google with the name I had, and yeah, it, it was here. So yeah, should have trusted myself. Never mind. <clears throat> so I only stopped just down the road, down that way. But so I just went around the block and come back in from this way so now we're pretty much heading back to where I've just come from to go do my next one which I have two pallets for and then two more deliveries after that so yeah, it looks like I'm going to be here forever because no one's going to stop and let me out Now it stopped one side, it's going the other. As it usually goes. Nope, you won't come in here, do you? Oh, Van, you let me go. Cheers, buddy. There we go, it's nice when someone eventually gets you out. <laughs> Alright, back to the east side of uh, Swansea. See you soon. Okay. Alright, we're just coming up on the next delivery now. I don't know if I've done this one or not. For some reason the name seems familiar, but it doesn't seem like it's in the right place for where that familiar place was. So, <laughs> I guess we'll find out in a bit. Oh, I think I'm suffering from a condition today called baby bladder. It's where you have to go to the toilet every five minutes. <laughs> so it's only been, what, two hours since I last went and I need to go again now. It's terrible. Any problem when you don't eat anything and then you have a big old drink is your uh, 
driving around, it just goes straight through you. Anyway, I'll stop being gross. Wake up then. Oh, well done. Huh. He's having a bit of a snooze, I think. Trust us to get caught with traffic lights, eh? So how many of you just picked up your phone then thinking your phone went off a Facebook message? <laughs> nope, that was me. No doubt he's got a Facebook message as well, but he likes to stop and check his. been around it before or not. Surely I would have been. I've done quite a lot around Swansea before. Alright, my way now BMW, thank you for that. Tell me it's up there. I'll keep going for it. It's not saying it's on that road. What was it actually say on the invoice? Hmm. Saying it's on this road, not that one. Not that that's going to always be right, but we'll give it a try. <sighs> Excuse me. We'll just drive aimlessly around the estate until we find it. I'm sure we'll get there eventually. and it's a slightly different name. Oh! Idiot. It is in that one. So I've got to come up here and stop it. I could be 
Yes, I can. Yes, I am. No animals permitted. Ah, oh, I better turn around. <laughs> right, I'll see you when I'm done. Okay, delivery done. I'm in the yard, so I need to put my seatbelt on. Don't legally have to wear seatbelts in the yard. Because I on the main road, and it has to be on. So that was nice and easy. I actually went into the wrong gate at first. I was supposed to go in the one I've just come out of, but I went in the one just beyond this trailer. And he said, you ain't been there before, have you? I was like, nope. He said, I can tell, because you've come to the wrong gate. <laughs> So I just had to back out and go back up the road. Weren't any issue. So yeah, I went around the side, straight on the bay, opened the doors, backed on. They took the stuff straight off, I've been there 10 minutes. Yeah, ideal. Go on here. What is going on here? Are you waiting or? Out there, or don't want. How about put your hazards on, mate, so someone knows? <laughs> anyway, yeah, back straight on the bay. Uh, got the two pallets off, sign the paperwork, and off I went. That simple. I like it when it's that simple. <laughs> right, two deliveries left. I have to stop for a break by 11. I'm gonna get. I'm due to get to the next stop by 22 past 10. So I might actually stop for my break before I go there. Just because. Because otherwise I'll get there and then it'll be. How many pallets I got? Two pallets. So I shouldn't theoretically be in there long. But. You know, if I'm in there for 20 minutes, I've then got, well, less than 20 minutes to try and, to try and find somewhere to stop. I don't know if I can get out, because I know there's a lay-by, but it all depends whether there's someone there or not. So, I think I'll have my break before I get there. So, we'll go do that, and I'll see you when I'm near the next delivery in Cowbridge. Goodbye, Swansea. It has been a pleasure. Alright, here we are, we're sort of just coming up to Cowbridge to go do our second to last delivery. So, I've gone and got myself an infringement. Oopsie. Uh, driving, after I sent the camera off, I checked my driving time and I was at four hours and I had about half hour, four, four hours, five minutes, so I had 25 minutes left. Now I was 20, no, 18 minutes away from the services I was trying to get to. So I had time, wasn't too bad. I had a good, what, seven minutes, six minutes, something like that. Unfortunately, as I was coming around Port Talbot on the M4, I hit some traffic. So that caused me to go a minute over my driving time. So I was sort of four hours 31. So unfortunately, yeah, I've got myself an infringement, so. You know, I did have time to get there, but traffic had other ideas, so I thought I could do about that. So what I'll do when I get back later on the day is I'll do a print out, and then I'll write on the back of the slip why I've gone over my driving time. So, you know, never mind, these things happen. It's all part of the job. Just means that one minute then could 
potentially cost me a hundred pounds, but we'll see. Anyway, I stopped up, had a 20 minute power nap, and now I'm feeling quite awake again, so that's pretty good. Just one of them things. Never mind. Alright. This one's usually a bugger to get in and out of just because. People don't like to let you go. What are you waiting for? Waiting for that car to go, are you? Oh dear. Have your it is on your left. Wait for these cars to go now before I can go anywhere. Still not enough room. You stay there a minute, Ford. That taxi is now holding everyone up because I can't go nowhere because of this car. I have to go cog so I can't get in with you there. Oh, you wait there, Mazda. Always fun in games, this one. So we'll pull up here, get him to get the gate open. I'm gonna make this delivery. Then off to the last one. See you when I'm done. I'm gonna try and get out of this car park. <laughs> See you shortly. All right, there we go. I sat delivery done. That wasn't too bad. Uh, two pallets off and nothing on. And he had a couple of pallets and the mate, he said, just leave it till next time. Or we'll leave it till tomorrow or something. Okay. Your shout. Didn't have a lot of room in there to move stuff around, so... That's fair enough. Alright, so now we've got to try and escape this car park. With everyone constantly driving down this way. Go on. i got to go that way. <laughs> Come on, people. Don't know why I thought I can get round there. Never mind. There we go. So what have we got to put up with? Uh, there's a car coming in. Are they going to give me the room I need? Oh, yeah, they are. They've seen me. Well done. Well done, Renault driver. Right, now to try and get out of it. This is always fun. I'll let them go because I'm nice. Alright. Uh -huh. That weren't too bad. We'll take that one. We'll be sat there for ages sometimes. <laughs> Okay, so we're now going to head off to our last delivery in Coldicott. So I'll see you in an hour. <laughs> That's how far away it is. Okay, just coming up on the last delivery now in Coldicott. Can't say that without a Welsh accent, it's just like against the law. <laughs> Yeah, we're almost here. We've got three pallets left on the truck, which is all for this place, obviously. 
just hoping they don't have a lot to go back. So it'll be nice to go back with nothing. <laughs> I'm going to have at least something, I know that. Now I have at least two, I would have thought, maybe four. I don't know. I really don't know. Yeah, it's half past 12 now, so when did I start for? Oh, they're eight and a half hours now. Yeah, eight and a half hours and about a two hour drive back to the yard. So, it'll be about ten and a half hour day to day, maybe 11 hours. Isn't too bad, I suppose. So you do some long old hours when you're trucking, but to be honest, as far as I'm concerned, the driving isn't working. It's just driving. <laughs> Obviously, that is what I get paid for, but it's not hard driving. It certainly has its moments, but uh, anytime I really do work, it's when I stop at the customers and uh, have to unload it. If it's a case of it being forklift off. It's not really difficult, is it? You just open up the curtains and just stand there like a Muppet until they uh, unload it. Hey, well, it's not for everyone. And it certainly is for me. <laughs> hey, diddly dee, your driver's life for me. Almost there. delivery off and I'll see you when I'm done. Right out. Last delivery of the day done. Which was lovely and easy. Three pallets off, three pallets on. That's all we got to go back with is three pallets. Which is wonderful. Oh, now we've got to get out of here without wheel spinning. There we go. Alright. So now, we're going to head on home. I should have really done that before I set off, but because it's easier to do. There we go. We'll do it now. I know it's naughty, but never mind. So, we have an hour and 56 minutes till we get back to the yard. So yeah. About yeah, it's gonna get. What is it? Uh, yeah, it's gonna be about just over eleven hours, I think, or just under eleven hours. It's gonna be close to eleven hours. We know that much. Yeah, so all in all, not too bad a day. Can't really complain. Obviously, then getting the infringement as well is not not the best thing, but hey, like I said it happens. If we went for the traffic, would have been all right. Never mind. Can't account for traffic all the time. Alright, I guess before these batteries run out, I'll leave that there. So if you got this far, thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for joining me along my journey. If you like the video, 
hit the thumbs up. If you didn't, thumbs down. It's that simple. Also, if you're not subscribed to the channel, hit that subscribe button. I release videos on Mondays and Thursdays at 8 p.m. UK time, but if you want notifications when my videos come out, then hit the little bell icon next to the subscribe button thing or majiggy. Also, share the video with someone you think might like it. And if you feel inclined to, then leave a comment on the video. Have you ever had an infringement? And have you ever been caught with it and got a fine? No clue, I've not been fined before, so touch wood, we'll be alright. 28 days, then we're clear. <laughs> uh, and what else? Oh yeah, if you haven't already, then check out my Facebook tape. <laughs> Facebook page w.facebook.com forward slash truckerjono where I sometimes post up pictures of either I have a break or when I'm stopped somewhere loading or something or other or if something's bugged me and I've got something to say about it. <laughs> there you go. So anywho Without further ado, let's leave the video there. And I bid you all farewell. Jolly good. <laughs> so yeah, take it easy, look after yourselves, drive safely. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbyes. <laughs>